Hey guys, today is day 22 of Moon Their MBA, and the person for today is uh, the interview was Karen Bela Mora, and uh, he's the founder, the co founder of Cobra Beer. So uh, I'm just going to go through the, the notes from his interview from the audio, and uh, the first one is credibility crap. Convincing add, add value, so um, so he's talking about the credibility, um, the credibility, credibility gap when in which like you you start you started from scratch, so you people don't know you, uh, uh, pe just, you know just you're you're new and. Uh, what credibility do you have? So you have to do a lot of convincing, and you have to add value in the marketplace. And uh, uh, once you know that, then uh, you know, then you have credibility, I think. So um, okay, the next one is a simple idea. Making that dream a reality is what it's all about. So you gotta have a simple idea. So, uh, Everything comes from an idea, and just making that dream into a reality. I mean, that's all. That's what it's all about, you know. So you got that. You got that something, you know, and you're dreaming about it, and you're feeling it, you know, and uh, you just like, oh, the next thing you know is like, wow, it's it's here. I got it, you know, and like it's manifested. So um, yeah. Okay, the next thing is you got to be creative and innovative. Self determine self determination at all odds. Create a super product. So uh, yeah, uh, creativity and innovation. I mean, you gotta have that. You got you gotta be a little bit different from everybody else. I mean, if everything was the same, it'd be pretty boring. So just be just be out there. Just be innovative and creative and uh, people will like it you know if you like it people like it then it's a win-win so uh, also self-determination I mean uh, you, you can't let yourself be in the negative uh, you can't state that enough I mean like you gotta be in the positive you know just be positive take the next step see the problem through don't just don't focus on the negative. I mean, I mean, uh, see through that illusion, and uh, self determination will get you there. I mean, if you if that's like your strongest desire and you're you have the most intense feelings about it, just I mean, that self determination would be there, be there, you know. So and also create a super product. I mean, if you make that product, you gotta make it super. I mean, just just a really good product and uh, you will be rewarded I mean because I mean like you created it and it fits what you want and you know it's all about you yeah uh, so okay the next thing is you got to be prepared to to put in the hard work now for me uh, putting hard work is uh, what well I'm, I'm pretty I, I get some a little, a little indecisive, and I I when I get indecisive, I just get a little lazy. So, but I'm willing to put in the hard work into my thing, and so um, so yeah, uh, you gotta be prepared, prepared. You know, you gotta uh, make sure you got everything you need, and that you get your sleep, you get your rest. That uh, you you schedule everything, you know what you gotta do, you research what you gotta do, you uh, you're just prepared, you know, and uh, you always have a backup plan in case things go wrong, and uh, you solve through the problems. I mean, uh, so yeah. The next thing is hiring great a great team makes a big a, a huge difference. So uh, for me, a team, uh, I really don't really have a team right now, So since I'm just starting out. So, but uh, my supplier, I consider him a team, so 
just getting him straight and me, uh, make sure he get me straight and uh, working together, being harmonious and uh, yeah, I mean, you gotta have great teams and in, in the future, I'm sure I'm gonna have to have more people. So um, and uh, if it starts getting a little too big, I need more people. So you know, uh, just hire great people, people who who you know you can count on and who who uh, know what your values are and will do what what it takes to get the job done. So. Uh, Okay, the next thing is, in the early days, it's important to have a mentor. Okay, I don't have a mentor. And there's just, I guess all these guys are mentors for me, but I really need a real mentor. A person who has done it before, who has the experience, who I could contact, and, um, you know, just give me that something when I need. When I have a problem and I can't s seem to solve it, and they're just there f for you for support and they give you your experience and how they did it. I mean, that's real helpful. I mean, just having that mentor, you know, because they got that huge experience. They went through the experience, University of Life, and you know, so. Okay, the next thing is you need to go out and meet people. There's so much support out there for businesses just go out there and get it. Oh man, there is a lot of support out there. I'm not gonna lie, and uh, I mean, you can do partnerships, you can merge, you you can just uh, buy services and uh, network with people, you know, and they're there to support you, you can support them, and you know, everybody has a benefit for everybody, and you know, for me, uh, you know, I'm gonna have to do that, and um, you know, I want to find the best suppliers and make sure I get the, uh, attract the best suppliers and, you know, just work it out with them, see what they got, uh, not be too willy-nilly, just, uh, just check it out, uh, yeah, you know, but don't go too far in, but, um, but yeah, uh, eventually I want to do that and go out to meet, uh, more people and more suppliers and, uh, uh, if I like what they got, then uh, we go from there. So anyways, and the last thing is getting that product right and consistently producing that product with good quality. So this guy, he was making a beer and uh, he was like, I gotta get that, this product right, you know, and consistently just producing that product with good quality, I mean, that's what it's all about and uh, I put that on here and for me, the product, the product, the product, my product's pretty right. Um, producing, I mean, consistently producing it with good quality. Uh, it does have a little bit of a, a little issue, but um, nothing too too bad. So, but uh, I do like uh, you know just making sure I just got the good quality to it and. Nothing like atrociously bad. If it's atrociously bad, and uh, why did the hell you give that to me? So uh, you need to fix it. You need to get to me. And um, so yeah, uh, the top five for from Karen Boromama. The key learnings. My top five from him is the credibility gap, convincing, add value. Because if you can't convince people, if if your service doesn't really add value to them, then you know you can't really do anything. Uh, number two is you got you have to be creative and innovative. So um, you know you gotta be a little crazy. You got to be out there. You got to be different. You got to be you know it's just you gotta be you gotta do that. You know you gotta be authentic. So next thing is self determination at all odds. I mean, if you're not determined to do this, then how the hell are you going to do anything related to that? So, um, yeah, just having that that uh, strongest desire, that strongest motivation to get you through, and that passion, and uh, well, those feelings you have for it, it'll get you there, and just do it at all odds.
Okay, number four, you got to be prepared to put in the hard work. Hard work is uh, just, well, I can do hard work. Just got to go um, push through the procrastination. I mean, what I get from procrastination is I hold it off and uh, hesitate and, you know, uh, indecision, then that's just... Uh, holding me back from my definite aim so I just gotta just keep on going and, uh, and not let that set me back not not get bribed just uh, be committed to what I'm doing and uh, the last one is uh, you need to actually yeah yeah the last one is you need to go out and meet people there's so much rapport out there for businesses just go out there and get it I mean, just get it. I mean, get that support, get that service, get that products. It's all out there. People are willing to help, and uh, if you help yourself, you can help them. So, so yeah, that's my uh, top five. And tomorrow will be Julie Meyer. She created First Tuesday in Andrea Capo. So um, she'd be pretty interesting. She does venture capital and she says oh, Ruby Tuesday right now oh, oh what is it first Tuesday never mind I, I don't know these uh, some of these UK companies but um, I'm sure she's pretty interesting and uh, maybe I'll see y'all tomorrow so see y'all there